Hi everyone, welcome to another edition of the EMSE Schedule video series. Today we're going to be showing you how to uh, authorize specific computers to be used as time clock PCs uh, to prevent people from being able to clock in um, you know, when they're not at your specific station. Uh, so what we're going to do first is you need to be signed in as an administrator and signed in as a time clock administrator as well. Um, then we're going to go over here to time clock and we're going to go to this option for authorized time clock PCs. So there's two ways that we can uh, authorize computers. The first is by external IP, which would basically make any computer uh, that's connected to the network at your station uh, be able to be used as a time clock computer. And all that you need to do to enable this function is to name your station. It automatically pulls the IP address that you're at and hit submit. So now any of the computers that are connected at the station at this IP address would be able to be used as a time clock PC. So we're going to get rid of that to show you the other option. So the other option would be if you want to only allow uh, specific computers within your station um, to be able to be used as a time clock PC, we're going to come down and we're going to use this MAC address um, authorization. So what we're going to do for this, uh, and there's some instructions here, and the most important thing that I want to stress is that you need to be using Internet Explorer for this to work. Um, so Internet Explorer should be listed as your default um, browser. Um, and that's really the only way that this works based on the, the programming. So the, you're, what you're going to need to do is download this script and this logon shortcut. And this shortcut is what you're going to use from on that time clock computer to, auth to access the time clock. So I've already downloaded those, so I'm going to close out of my browser. And we're going to come up here and we're going to run the script that we downloaded. And we'll just hit yes and yes. And you'll see that it's been updated in the registry that for the time clock. And now this is the shortcut that we also downloaded. So we're going to open this up and it'll open in Internet Explorer. And now we're going to sign back in. And now you'll see when we go to well, we have the clock in option because this is the computer that's listed as a, uh, a time clock PC. And when we come down here to authorize time clock PCs, in here it's going to list the MAC address of our computer. So what we'll do is we'll label this as um, whatever station we're at. We'll hit submit. And now the time clock is locked down to this specific computer um, on my network. So no other computers would be able to be used uh, to clock in and clock out. So those are the two, two methods that we can use to um, authorize time clock PCs um, and kind of restrict access to the clock in, clock out feature uh, to specific areas um, you know, within your station. If you have any questions, of course, feel free to get in touch with our support line. Um, thank you for taking the time to watch this video today.